Meanwhile, new details reveal the violent deaths of two people that were murdered almost four years ago. From a New Mexico Mobile newsroom, it was day two of the trial for a woman accused of double homicide. She is 34-year-old Crystal Cardenas. She is accused of slayings, the slayings of Vanessa Rodriguez Mora and Mario Cabral, her, uh, his, uh, her ex-boyfriend. Both Cardenas and Cabral were in a bitter custody dispute. ABC7's Rosemary Montañez has been following this trial. In its video, you'll see only on ABC7. New details were revealed in this Doña Ana courtroom. We learned that between both victims, they received up to 15 gunshot wounds throughout their body. And we want to warn you that some details may be disturbing. The cause was gunshot wounds. And the manner of death? Was homicide. Eight witnesses took the stand Tuesday. One key witness, Dr. Emily Helmridge, is a forensic pathologist. She said she reviewed the autopsies. According to her, both died of multiple gunshot wounds. Dr. Helmridge said Vanessa Mora was shot a total of three times, once to her head, her chest, and her left breast, while her boyfriend, Mario Cabral, was shot 12 times, and six of those gunshot wounds were to his lower body. In this case, he had 12 gunshot wounds total, and the gunshot wounds involved his head, his left arm, his right arm, abdomen, back, right and left thighs. As the pathologist, could you tell us how Mr. Cabral got his injuries and in what sequence Mr. Cabral got his injuries? There's no scientific way to determine that, no. Also during the trial, the defendant, Crystal Cardenas, was seen very calm, at times taking notes, paying attention to testimony, and sometimes smiling when speaking with her defense attorney. And the trial is expected to continue tomorrow. Count on ABC7 for complete coverage. Reporting in Las Cruces with our New Mexico Mobile Newsroom, Rosemary Montañez, ABC7.